What's up, Hyantas? Caught me with my pants down, huh? <laughs> Today's gonna be a fun day. We're heading over to Shifted Performance. Go hang out, uh, I guess the RS. You know, the one that put the Twin Scroll Spoolie Boy on, almost made full hunted. Um, the owner decided to go bigger, go with a 2.5 block and uh, some bigger turbo. We'll find out. We'll go to Shifted Performance, get the details on that today. Um, this morning, we're gonna be finishing up this brake job on the SI. We're rolling with some StopTech rotors with some Posi Quiet pads. K Series parts had a great sale. So I got the whole front Shibanga Boo for like $250. So we got the front all buttoned up, ready to go. Um, working on the rear, we still got this one to do. And we're about halfway done with this side. So we're gonna get that buttoned up. We're gonna hop in the Civic, get the pads bedded in so this thing's 100% ready to go. This little bad boy needs some tires. Been doing too many burnouts on this thing. Needs an alignment too. But this thing's almost fully maintenance up, boys. This thing's looking hot, boy. Hot, 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 boy. Um, so yeah, let's do a couple time lapses. Get these brakes wrapped up, get the garage cleaned up, and head over to shift it in the afternoon. All right, you little hyantas. Let's get this party started. So check out this handy dandy flashlight. You stick this little hyanta right here. Bang, look at that. Isn't that sick, boy? Ah, there we go, so we can see what we're doing here. All right, let's get to work. All right, let's take a little venture over here. Got some pretzels, got some pads. I think this is for that side. Let's go find my pads, huh? Probably over here. Where's my pads, guy? What am I supposed to do? Sweat? Come on. Come on. All right, here we go. So, where's my hardware? Hardware is installed already. All right, boys. Got my CRC brake caliper grease. So we want to apply a little bit wherever, wherever metal's touching metal. So on the back here, a little bit right here, right here. Uh, anywhere it's gonna be metal on metal contact, that's gonna help prevent squeaky doos. So let's get a little bit of applied on there and get this project rolling. You know, you don't wanna get too crazy with it, it'll dabble do ya. This, you want to make sure that you get the high temp brake caliper grease because it won't melt at the temperatures that your brakes see. Finesse that around right here. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha, big guy. Big guy with the big brakes. Actually, these are small brakes, but hey. Over here. All right, let's get this first one all set in and dandy. Because I like candy. I want candy. Da, 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 da. There we go. Hot cigarettes. Get your hot cigarettes on aisle three. Keep those hands clean. All right, where's the other brake pad at Hyenta? Right here. Make sure we're all congruent. Congruent on West Coast. West Coast Hyenta. Ha 
I want candy. <laughs> Yeah, I want no squeaky hyantas. I want congruency, horizontalness, ballet banting. You guys want to go ballet banting after work, huh? You guys working today, huh? What are you guys doing today? You guys hanging out with your wings out? What you doing? Tell me, tell me in the comments below what you're doing. Ozzy Bear wants to know he's a rooster after all, huh? All right, put it on just like that. Why does that not seem right? Ah, never mind. Ah, there we go. A little. Wherever that metal's gonna hit the metal. Nice and finesse it in there. Wipe off this excess real quick. And install the unit. Installing unit. Why am I fighting something, huh? What am I fighting here? So on the rear, uh, you got a, it's got a weird type of piston. You don't take a C-clamp, you take something and move it in all the way, turning it clockwise. This might be what I'm running into here. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh, you like that candy? Huh, boy? Get my bolts in there. Oh yeah. Oh, you gonna make me sweat, boy? You gonna make me sweat on these brakes? Working on this yesterday. Taking my time. Taking my time in Ozzy Bear's garage. Need a little 12 milli, huh? 12 milli make me silly. There we go. That's our, there's some congruency right there. Why are you gonna make me sweat? Torque spec on the caliper bracket itself is 55 foot pounds. And on this uh, caliper right here is 17 foot pounds. We got the torque wrench dialed in. Done. And done. All right, this side's buttoned up. Let's do a time lapse for that other side. We got this sucker all buttoned up. Front's looking good. Rear's all done. We're just gonna clean up this mess and then we're gonna head out. So let's clean up the garage and then head out of here. Our hyentas. I like to clean up my tools after every time I use them. Keep them nice and fresh. Would you like a pretzel? Squirt a little uh, APC on there. Wipe it off a little microfiber. And you can call it a day, huh? Keeps your tools looking nice, fresh, organized, and clean. Spent all these money on it, might as well keep them legit on Twit, Twitter, Twitter, huh? Dogecoin on Twitter, huh, big guy? I might head on out. Get a big old trout. Get a trout at the store. 
What more could you ask for? Knock on the door. I'm just rhyming today, high end does. Huh? Hold oh, this picture! They're completely all the way worn down on the inner shoulder, so this thing definitely needs an alignment. And they're all beat up for me doing burnouts too. But we need some new boys on here soon. Civics on the ground and torqued. Make sure our brake fluid reservoir is full. And we're gonna take it for a rip. Boom, making some lunch. And then we out. Boom. Finish up lunch with a little bit of boost bears. Everything is lined up now. You see this mark. You can sort of see that little arrow on the block up with that dot. So everything is as it should be. Alright, hi Antas. Now we got a little, little groceries in our belly. Uh, we're gonna head over to Shifted Performance. Uh, did a little bit of research. Thank goodness I did. Uh, you're not supposed to bed in these brake pads like you would performance pads. These are just regular street pads, I guess you would call them if you will. Um, if you do that it It'll glaze the rotor a little bit and appear like you have a warped rotor. So we don't want to do that. Just easy driving for 100 miles and then brake as is. So that's cool. Brakes are done. We're going to enjoy those on the way to shifted. Let's go see what the boys are up to. Let's put some high quality nectar in this thing. Come on, bro, get that loud ass Harley out of here. 318 divided by 10.6. Damn it. 318 divided by 10.6. Damn, 30 miles to the gallon, and I drive this thing hard, bro. I love this car. What a great car. Even when I was here, yeah. you were still okay. yeah. so Oh, look, we got Godzilla in the back room here, huh? Nasty lizard. Got some nasty lizards back here. Old school GTR, new GTR. We chilling. <laughs> What's up, Hyenta? This guy. What's up, Hermano? That's hot. Looks like Ronnie's doing a clutch over here. New flat flywheel, all hot boy. Ready to go. All right, time to draw Ronnie's cock. We're gonna draw him a twin scroll cock. See, look at this masterpiece. It looks just like the twin scroll gasket. <laughs> twin scroll cock. <laughs> that's what Ronnie's, Ronnie's work for. That's good, that's good. There you go, Ronnie. Twin scroll cock. This was Clinton was talking about. They got a fresh 2.5 block with the version 8 heads. And he's going with the bigger twin scroll turbo, the Dom 3.0. So this thing's gonna make for sure over 400. Nice and fresh and clean from the machine shop. Three eagle valve grind, all that cool stuff. So he's gonna scoot. Car parts everywhere here. Gates racing bell, all sorts of Japanese racing parts. Killer B. From over here, they got a build coming in for a GR, STI. All sorts of cob goodies. Oh, he's over here sharing your, your butt with the world. Huh? You find this tranny on 4th Street? <laughs> Tug. Clayton, would you put a Mitsubishi badge on a Subaru? No. Why do you put in Cornwell oh sleeve on a Milwaukee tool, Ronnie? Because I'm not going to pay the extra 20 bucks or whatever for a Milwaukee sleeve. Oh, that's a sin, brother. I got a spare nut. I got a spare nut for you, huh? 
This little Hyanta has got that transmission in. That'll wrap it up here at Shifted Performance for the day. We'll go home, see what's chilling. Yeah, my baby girl loves boost bears. Blue raspberry boost bear. I'll bite off half. Look at her. The nummy num num num. Alright, boys. The room was bringing me a. Ice cold cream, and so I think we'll end the vlog right here. <laughs>